All right, three or four. It's kind of dark. I don't know if it's going to show up or not. I got some peppermint and some spearmint. And we'll go out there and look at the garden. You can see it's showing up pretty good out there. Anyway, I'm going to pause this so I can go down the steps. Oh, wait a minute. Spirit. Spirit forest in there. And look at that. Anyways, I'm going down the steps. Hold on. All right. Spirit forest. Tammy. Here's my herbs I planted. Got them planted kind of late. Anyways, we got some basil. And I got their thyme. We got sage. Back here we got a little plant of rosemary. So I don't know how that's going to grow this year, but I didn't have time to put it in the garden. It's too kind of late. Anyways, I'll be back in a minute. I'm going to walk out to the garden. Oh, wait a minute. Let's go fishing. Come on, Spirit. Let's go fishing. Here's my honey crisp apple tree right there. Hope it does something. Ain't, blo ain't bloomed out or done nothing in a few years. Young tree, but anyways, if it don't bloom next year, I'm cutting it down. Our fire pit. We have fires out there and cook on stuff. I guess I should tape that someday. Anyways, let me pause this for a minute so I can walk out by the garden. All right, there's the corner. It's hard to see what I'm... The sun's behind my back. And it's really shining on this screen. Anyway, the corn... We'll get a couple... few good messes, I guess. You can see it going through, but... Kind of got gappy. We got... A lot of rain there for a while, and then we got... A bad storm that blew it out. That blew it over, not out. Anyways... See, I can't talk like you, Spirit Forest, or you, Aaron, or Calvin. You guys can talk like the storm. Anyways, there's the corn. I'm going to pause it because I don't have no stabilizers on this, and I'll walk over the tomatoes. They're the ones that's made a big difference. If you remember last time I told you, it was only about, it looked like it was only about an inch tall, and that's they were, but wait till you see how they look now. Okay. hope it's recording. Anyways, there's the tomatoes. You remember how little they were? Just little old dinky things last time I recorded. There's 30-something tomatoes here. Going all the way back. Anyways, the other stuff's coming up pretty good. Cabbage looks a lot bigger. Let me pause this and go around to the side of the garden. Spirit Forest, Tammy, if you was here, i I grab you up and throw you ace right in that water. <laughs> I'd throw you in there and dunk your head. Anyways, I'm the next to I go back over the garden now. Okay, we had to replant the peppers, but they're coming up. You can see them right there. They're back there too. I don't know if I can zoom it up or not. Yeah, they're back there. There's one. Anyways, let's walk over here. See if I can walk out. And we got some more stuff coming up here. We had one yellow squash come up. One. Well, I think there's maybe two in there. We, don't, we never did clip the other one. But we replanted right back. Right back. I don't know if we can see. Uh, I can't see my hand anyways. Let me zoom it. Back there we planted two more. And we plant three more over here, right down there. Sorry, I'm so jerky. Yeah, I'm going to pause it so I can walk down the edge of the garden. All right. There's a zucchini squash. It's coming up pretty good. But we still had three that didn't come up right. There's the, right there's the zucchini. And right over here, there's a row that we had to replant. We got a long growing season, so maybe the come up there's the 
Not hot, sweet banana peppers. All right, let me pause this. I'm gonna walk down. Well, while I'm here, there's, there's the other tomatoes in their cages. Hope this is showing up. Sun's awful bright. I can't see, sorry about that. I can't even see what my screen's getting. Anyways, I'm going to pause and walk down to the, down to the cantaloupe, or muskmelon, whatever you guys want to call it. I call it cantaloupe. Anyways, I don't know if I've been getting this on, off a of pause or not, but <clears throat> we got one cucumber coming up. And we replanted down through here. So maybe they'll come up. There's no stray dog that come up. She was skin and bone. She was she was bony. Looked like a skeleton, but we fed her up and brought her back. Anyways, she's laying right between the cantaloupe and muskmelon, whatever you want to call them. I call them cantaloupe. Got six of those. I know I'm moving kind of fast. I'll just go back over this again because I don't know if I was hitting, doing the pause button right. The screen so bright I couldn't see the pause button. So I might not even turn it on when I got the other thing. But anyway, like I said, there's one cucumber. And it gets wet back here. This is the lowest part of the garden that sometimes water stands. But we replanted down through there. I guess I can bring it back down. Anyway, I'll walk back down the garden here a little bit. Anyways, I think I got the back of the tomatoes. A little bit more shade back here. They don't grow quite as fast as the front ones. Got about 36 plants in those two rows. So far, I like this black... I like this black ground barrier. Weed barrier, whatever you want to call it. Let the rain get right through. Keep the weeds out. Anyways, let's walk down here in case I missed this. In case I didn't get that. There's our, there's our cabbage. Got one, two, three, four. We just trying it out. We never, we don't grow cabbage too often. We love it, but bugs seem to always get it. But we put some seven dust on that baby. Anyway, there it is. There's the old boat. Right there. There's the old blue truck. That's just waiting for Spirit Forest. So she'll take a cruise with me down Lake Michigan shoreline. <laughs> Anyways. I guess I take that out, no wonder. Holy cow. Yeah, that's better. There's our other boat. We got the motor off it. It's just got a bunch of they got a bunch of garden junk in it. Yep. We got a we got the motor off. We're getting ready to take it in and get it fixed. Anyway, I don't know if I got this part. Just in case I didn't. I'm so wiggly, but I'm walking. I'm gonna take Spirit Forest, oh Tammy, and I'm gonna throw her in that pool. <laughs> I'm gonna grab you right up, throw you over in it, and then I'm gonna dive over and I'm gonna dunk you head right under the water, girl. Yeah, I'll dunk you. Anyways, I'm just kidding. I gotta get a kick out of messing with Tammy. She's my buddy. Anyways, there's some more of the yard down there. Driveway. There's the little car over there. Anyway, let's go take a little quick look at the front yard. Anyway, there's old chicken coops. Ain't got no chickens right now. We got two chicken coops. Another one over here. Hey, I might get some, uh, some fryer chickens and grow them. 
I've always wanted to try that. Anyway, let me zoom this back out. Anyway, this is the side of the lot. Trampoline, it's just tore up. A little big old tree limb fell on it. Looks like they got, we got the cover off of it, got it off. Now we gotta take that old, I don't know if we get a new cover for it or if we're gonna just take the whole thing down and just get a new one. Anyway, that fence row over there, you guys, I don't know if you can see it or not. It's a, it's a little, what do you want to call it, a little highway, a little animal highway trail for, see bobcats coming up and down it. One was holding a rabbit one time. See coyotes, deer all the time. They just like traveling right through there. Anyway, I could sit right up here, sit right out here and get me a deer if I wanted to. Anyways, uh, I don't want to shoot him right in the yard. Anyways, let's go check the front yard, then I'm out of here. Okay, I took videos of the chicken coop, I hope. This bright sun making the screen look like a mirror and I can't see the numbers if they're turning or if it's paused or not paused. Anyway, I think it's going now. Let's get over in shade and I'll make sure. i just take you over this, over our other part of our property over here on the side lot. Yeah, that's better. No, you guys might be able to see. Sorry about being so jerky. I'm walking this thing got a stabilizer. Anyways, there it is. Side lot. I'll go back over there. Front yard. Alright, let's go back there. I'm going to pause it though. That's the front part of our property on the side. Hello there, Corky. You get around. She looks a lot better. And she did. And there's the big walnut tree. Black walnut. It's big. It's been here. This thing was here when I was a young man. I was just 19 when we first moved here. Anyways. Let's go around here. This is a front part of our... Uh, this is the other side of our property, but this is the front part. And it goes on back... Deer travel this side too. They just love running this. Anyway, and there's goes back to the back. Back there. I buried Pixie back there under the trees. I missed that little girl. Anyways, that's just a little bit of property. Let's go to the front yard. I know I'm probably moving fast. We leave that area over there. We could cut it down, but we always left that for the deer kind of sneak through there. There's like sneaking right through there. Anyways, let's go to the front yard. This paint gonna be that great of quality. All right, here's the front yard. We gotta cut that down. Anywheres, like I said, front yard. Okay, I'm gonna pause this. For okay, I'll just go around and I'm gonna get out of here. Is anybody getting that hickory in here? I'm getting the mirror effect again. Anyways. Here's a monster hickory tree right there. It's, it's big. It's bigger than what it looked like on camera. And I'm going to know I'm going to do something to turn this back down. All right, everybody. That's good enough. I just thought while I was doing the garden, I'd take a little walk around the house. All right. I'm going to pause it. There's the 20 horse, Aaron. We got tore down. Been doing a little bit of work on it, but we're going to take it in though, have it tuned up right. Anyways, I just want to show Aaron Nelson this old motor. We're going to get better, we're going to get it going, buddy. Anyways, there's the old Buick. It's dusty. 
I don't know why cars have to come by right when I'm doing this. Look at everything, they're piling everything up on my mom's car. Well, my car, no. Anyways. It's a working garage. Let me see. And the ladders and stuff. Anyways, I'm out of here. I'm going to go up on the porch. Oh, yeah. Pull them on up there, Aaron. Pull them up. Pull them up. Pull them up, buddy. You can do it. Just don't fall off them. Don't fall off them ramps. Hey, Spirit Forest. What are you going to do when I come pulling up there on your property? Tammy out there at Spirit Forest. I'll have my wheelbarrow back here. I'll get my chainsaw on there. I come, <laughs> I come up in the old blue truck. I drive all the way to Colorado on this baby. Here to go. Hey, we'll hook it up some trees and stumps. We'll pull stumps out with it. And anyway, I got my wheelbarrow already and loaded. I'll be out there. In, I'll be out there soon, buddy. Old Tammy at Spirit Forest. Help you get that land cleaned up. Hey, Spirit. I guess I can clean that topper up. Need to be cleaned up. Throw a mattress and some sleeping bag back there. And hey, I'll put down truck and I'll just park out there in Spirit Forest. <laughs> I just sleep out of that. Get up in the morning and start clearing property. All right, messing with my buddy. Oh, wait a minute. The bird's eye view of the front end. Here she is. 1989. It's old. 300,000 on it. It still come to Colorado.